hey, can I suggest to you to read Psalms 103.1 on this, thank God it's Thursday. And the Psalm reads, bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Now, I'm just going to spend a few minutes with you to talk about some things that I want to suggest that maybe you can be thankful for. If you can't find something, you're saying, oh my gosh, thank God I'm living and breathing and this is what he has given me today. So here are three of the suggestions. Number one, do the things that you love, those things that absolutely speak to your heart, that brings you joy, that you know that you could do even if you never got paid for it, and you are doing that right now or you have done it today, or you are working towards that thing, if we can stay grateful, if we can keep our mind focused on those things that we do well, those things that we can add um, to the people that are around us, to a wider um, audience, or to, you know what, sometimes it's personally to yourself. If you can do those things that you, that you absolutely love, if it's, you know, doing a painting, doing some writing, you know, going surfing, and anything that just makes your heart sing, make that a part of your day. Incorporate that into your day, and then that way you can be thankful, you can be grateful without any kind of hang-ups. Number two, being a creative person. Because we all have something that we are very talented in. We have things that we can speak, actions that we can take, something that people say, oh my God, if you weren't offering that, where would I be? Just the fact that you, you got up and you, you took in a breath today means that you're an, a creative person. Just the fact that you are able to sit with me and give thanks, or raise your hand or sing some praise and worship music, just in that fact, you were created to have a joyful noise and to give God praise. And number three, taking risks because everybody doesn't do it. I mean, you think that everybody does, but that's not a necessary given. And so just in the fact that you're able to step out when other people will not, you know what I'm saying? You should give yourself a big kudos, a big pat on the back and say, oh my gosh, how well am I doing today? Because I have stepped out and did something outside my comfort zone. So be willing and always um, have the ability to praise yourself, to, to let your voice be heard in your own ear and tell yourself, well, well done to you, okay? So I hope that this has been beneficial on this. Thank God it's Thursday. I hope that you will subscribe, like, and share. Hit that notification bell and leave me a comment and I will talk to you later. Okay, bye.